What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to Street League Racing Redline. It's been a while, man. I'm, I'm sorry that I disappeared for a few days. Uh, my computer essentially just fucking died. Uh, that's uh, unfortunate, but it, in the end, it is. Uh, it, it, it seems that it didn't die. It just some weird BIOS shit happened, uh, and I fixed it. So we've got the R32 slightly banged up. You know, let's go. Let's do some street racing. Not street racing. Let's go some. Let's do some drifting. But before we do some drifting. Can we do some interior mods? Because we need to make this thing be, be you know, the shit. It, it needs to be a drift car because we are going to FD with this car. We're going to, to Japanese FD. Uh, I just noticed we don't have that much money left. So, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to go too wild with this shit. Uh, I just want to see if there are tinted windows for this car. I want some tinted windows, but oh, there are. There are boys, very nice, very good. Alright, so let's throw a nice... No, that's, that's the original wheel. Let's throw a nice gnarly wheel, dude, gnarly. Let's throw a nice row cage. Oof, boys, that's nice. A nice set of gauges that you cannot see. That's also nice. Ooh, that fits so well with, with, the, with the red interior. I like that. We might do some red accents in this car. Uh, let's throw away all the windows. We don't need windows. Install the door. Remove the door and add some nice tinty boys. Nice. 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 Very nice. Uh, let's sell all these parts. We can get eight, four, $5,000 for those parts. You know, that's pretty good, I guess. It's <laughs> pretty, pretty fucking good. Um, the car is taking shape. The car is really taking shape. But the, the problem, the thing that's not taking shape is this less than ideal engine 32 34% 38 30 something alternate fucking topless timing cover at 0% but that that always happens so I'm not really too sh uh, too spooked about that I think we can do two laps with this with this setup I think we can throw down two laps no problem you know last time I did throw down three laps and bad things happened so you know you going to watch out for these two laps Yeah, the, the engine is already on the down low, so I'm gonna I'm gonna watch out. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go I'm not gonna throw down uh, red line too much, even though I am just sitting here redlining like crazy. <laughs> I really like the lead lights though. That's pretty cool. Oh, okay. Third gear is absolutely gone. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm gonna preserve the engine because this is this is this is worrisome now. This is very worrisome because if we're not gonna make it two laps, man, I, I mean, I'm, I'm throwing this engine fucking away. I'm what I'm trying to do is get money to build another RB to build a proper stage four RB. Not even that much about the power. I'm just I just want something more reliable because this one I, I cannot just drift two laps and need to do a fucking engine rebuild. It's just not my style, you know, it's just not my style. This third gear, like, slow motion drifting is my favorite, honestly. Oop. Let's not hit those walls. I'm just trying to keep it off the red line, dudes, because this is... A nice little clutch kick, but that's okay. That doesn't damage the engine. It damages the clutch and the drivetrain. Probably does some damage, some engine wear too. But I don't, man, I, I can't. Don't, I can't. <coughs> what the fuck? I can't throw down uh, some epic slides right now because of the the engine situation we have uh, we have found ourselves in. So I, you know, I got I got to drive cautiously because we we don't want to end up fucking stranded somewhere in a fucking parking lot. In the middle of fucking Japan, that's now would not be optim optimal, especially since uh, it seems that our uh, base, our home base, our garage, is um, our shop is somewhere in the middle of fucking America. It just seems like America, that you know, you don't, or maybe somewhere else. I don't know if America has water. Uh, <coughs> I don't even know what the fuck that means, dude. Because uh, because because Valo City has a canal, you know, but it's a very dry canal. So I guess 
LA has a dry canal. We might be in some kind of discount LA. But there's not a lot of, uh, there's not enough uh, violence in it to be LA, so, you know. I don't know. Probably somewhere like Midwest or some shit. I don't know. Oh, come on. It just has to live for a few corners. Nah, we're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. So, okay. It's okay. It's, if it can still move in third gear, we are good. We are good. Oh, slight jump drift. Enjoyable. Whoa, shit, that was very close to you, whoa. Going the speed I was going, that could have ended very nicely. Minus 360 for crashes. I don't think I crashed. Pfft, I guess I crashed, you, you know. Why would SLR lie to me? This is the ultimate game. Uh, it, would, it would never do something like lie to me. Fucking SLR. Uh, let's see, let's see how much we have, how much engine wear we have. 20%. 15, how's the crank? No, that's the alternate. The engine block, 20%. I cannot get to the crank shaft. That is okay, that is okay. Uh, tires are slightly quite worn. Um, this engine is very damaged, boys. It's uh, turbo is at 0%. 0%. I mean, we are boosting 6.7 fucking bars through that thing, which is not realistic at all. Um, but, uh, but in other news, the car looks pretty... Oh, I did hit, apparently, something. I don't know what, though. Oh, it's probably from some of the jumps or some shit. I don't think I've hit a wall, but... This doesn't look too... <laughs> it doesn't look too good, does it? So, I think I want to throw the car through paint. I want to make it look... You know, get get this thing finished. But first, we need to remove the bumper that is fucked. We need to remove the quarter panel that is fucked. And uh, anything else on this car right now fucked? No. So, let's do a nice uh, repair. What? What do you mean it's already repaired as, as much as possible? Oh, this game, dude. This fucking game. As far as possible. Okay, so I basically need to buy them again. As far as possible? As far as possible, yeah. Let's uh, sell these two parts for 1.6 grand. And go out and buy them because they cannot be repaired. <laughs> Whoopty fucking do, mother... Oh, my God. I don't even know what, which parts they are. Mm, this, this optimal, I guess. I need the S13, S15 front bumper. It doesn't say S15 on any of these. At least we know it's the right rear, rear quarter. Which one of these fucking bumpers is it, man? I think it's this one with the carbon fiber. With the carbon fiber. We, you know, we, we gotta get the car paint prep. I don't know, man. I still don't know which one I, I would like. You know what? I'm gonna go with this one. I don't know. It just kind of looks more skyline-y. But let's, let's go through paint. Let's see what we can do about paint for this car, because it has red accents inside. But I don't know. If, I don't. I don't know if I want to make it red. You know, no, no, I'm not gonna make it red because the. Well, I can actually have the roof a different color. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool and rare. I'm not gonna have it red, even though I just painted the whole car red, because my other skyline was red. So let's let's do something other, something different. A nice deep blue. What about a base side blue? Or a baby blue, I guess. That's more of a baby blue. Oh, a nice purple. A purple GTR. I mean, it is a drift car. It is a drift car, after all. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Uh, I want some colors, dude. I want something... No paint jobs? No paint jobs? Fuck. I want something nice, man. I don't know. I'm not feeling any of these. And honestly, in all honesty, a nice white GTR. But it looks so basic. It looks so basic. That and... I nah, just kind of looks ricey now, doesn't it? Because I wanted to have, like, red accents because of the interior. Actually, black, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, now this fits the car very well. I think I've got it, boys. So, oops. Damn, I like how black looks. We might switch it up later. So, right now, the whole idea is we've got a bunch of color schemes right now. We've got the white main, we've got the black everywhere, and the li little red accents with the interior. Very, very nice. Okay, we've got something b brewing here. And the red calipers and the red text inside. We've got something good brewing here, boys. This is pretty good. This is pretty good. I actually like how this pipe looks. It's just, it's just, it's still just a straight pipe, but it kind of just looks good. I don't think I'm going to change that. Oh, you can actually see, like, red inside here through the thing. GTST, would, would, would I be able to change that? No, I, I don't think I can change that. 
I would like to throw out a nice uh, GTR. What if I think there is street body parts? I think there is a clean trunk. Yeah, clean trunk. We don't need GTST sayings on the back. We don't need that. Let's remove this. Oh damn! I also like how this looks, man. Shit! Is this the right white color? I don't think it's the right white color. Yeah, it was right. It was not the right. Oh, these are also not the right white color. Okay, boys. I think we've got ourselves a nice car. We got ourselves a very nice car. What the fuck happened with the fit? Oh, I just haven't fixed the fitment. Oh, makes sense, makes sense, makes sense. But the fitment fixing will come next time, guys. Thank you for watching this episode of Street Legal Drifting, Budget, Everything. And uh, I'm, I'm going to see you in the next one.